Today, ladies and gentlemen, esteemed participants and distinguished guests, it is an honor to stand before you today to discuss the vital topic of implementation of an excellent human resources management program in encouraging Sharia economics, growth, and exports in South Tangerang. In navigating the intersection of human capital and Sharia economics, we embark on a journey toward sustainable community development. Let us explore the transformative potential that lies within the synergy of robust HR practices and the principle of Sharia, contributing to the prosperity of South Tangerang and beyond. The title is about implementation of excellent human resource management program in encouraging Sharia economic growth exports in South Tangerang. Introduction. South Tangerang is a city in Indonesia that has a great economic potential, especially in the Sharia economic and export sectors. This presentation aims to investigate and explore strategies and steps that can be taken in implementing an excellent HR management program in encouraging Sharia economic growth and exports in South Tangerang. The main objective is to provide practical guides and effective solution to stakeholders in the region. The overview of South Tangerang, number one, South Tangerang is a city in Indonesia with a great economic potential. Number two, serious and integrated efforts from various parties are needed. Number three, one effort is to implement an excellent HR management program. Number four, the Sharia economic and export sectors are of special focus. Challenges in Sharia economic development. Sharia economic development and increasing export are important focus areas in South Tangra. Excellent human resources with knowledge in Sharia economics are required. Lack of deep understanding of Sharia economics in the region. The overcoming HR management challenges. Number one, problems in implementing an excellent HR management program in South Tangerang. Number two, lack of understanding, lack of quality human resources, and lack of support from government and society. Number three, research and development of excellent HR management programs are needed. The importance of excellent HR management. Number one, excellent HR management is crucial for economic growth. Number two, implementation in the context of Sharia economics and exports. Number three, overcoming challenges and encouraging development. Number four, serious and integrated efforts from various parties. The increasing Sharia financial literacy. The community development activities with the theme of economic empowerment through excellent human resource management Sharia financial literacy and export for creative economy entrepreneurs in the East Kiputat Subdistrict South Tangerang is presented by Dr. Lukman Hakim, Sarjana Ekonomi, Akutansi, Magister of Science, as a Dean of Economic and Business Faculty, Muhammadiyah Jakarta University. The aim of this session is to increase understanding of Sharia financial concept and their application in managing finance wisely and sustainably. And next is about development of quality human resources. The session delivered by Mrs. Diana Hassan, Sarjana Ekonomi, Magister Management, a lecturer from Economic and Business Faculty, Muhammadiyah Jakarta University. The aim of the session is to highlight the value of quality human resources in achieving growth and sustainability in creative economy business, increasing exports. The aim of the session is to provide a broad view of the opportunities and challenges in global trading and practical guidance on managing the export and import. The session conveyed by Dr. Handy Prehanto, Sarjana Ekonomi, Magister Akutansi, the Deputy Dean, Economic Business Faculty, Professor Dr. Mustopo University, and myself, and myself, I am Yudhistira Adwimurti, as a Head of the Quality Assurance Center, Economic and Business Faculty, Professor Dr. Mustopo University.
The benefits of community development activities, number one, encourage creative economic growth in the region. Number two, enables local business sector to compete in the global market. Number two, enables local business actors to compete in the global market. The result and discussion. Number one, increase Sharia financial literacy. Number two, development of quality human resources. Number three, increase exports. Number four, improve the skills and knowledge of business actors. Number five, increase networking and collaboration. Number six, increase awareness about the importance of the creative economy. The documentation. The conclusion, the community development activities also shows the commitment of the Faculty of Economic and Business, Professor Dr. Mustafa Bragama, and Faculty of Economic and Business, Muhammad Dia University, Jakarta, and the East Chiputat District Office in supporting the development of the creative economy in the region by increasing literacy, understanding, Sharia finance, excellent human resource management, and understanding export and imports, it is hoped that local business actors can achieve better growth and have a positive impact in local communities. In broader context, these community development activities also shows the importance of the rural universities in supporting the development of the creative economy at the local level. By holding activities such as community development activities, universities can help local business actors improve their ability and competitiveness as well as encourage economic growth in the region and competitiveness as well as encourage economic growth in the region. Thank you for your time and attention.